Hey, we're at North Crest RV Park. I uh, wanted just to give a quick overview. This is a great place. We uh, really have enjoyed being here. So overall, I would say very first, if you're looking for a place to, to stay, the North Crest RV Park's been great to us. Don't you think, Scotty? Uh-huh. Um, sorry, we had a lot to do today, so I don't have a lot of time to do a, a review of this, but just a couple things to note about the RV Park. One, it's right off of Interstate 35. So very easy to get to. Also, there's a highway on the other side, which means if you're trying to get down into Waco or the sites, it's very easy to, to jump on a road and get there. Now, right now, I-35 is under a lot of construction, which will probably last for the next year, it looks like. I mean, they're doing some major stuff, so you gotta watch out for that. Also, we can't say enough about RV Park Mark. He's awesome. Uh, he's been really great to talk to, really good to talk with our kids. Just overall, one of those guys that you love talking to. Magic carpet. We'll get that. That's the last thing to go in. Oh, that's, guys... that's after the kids. Oh yeah, they, they, they uh, <laughs> we'll throw them on top. Jump ship, jump ship. Come on, jump, jump off, ship. guys. Jump off. Come on. Bye. Come on. Thank Say you. thanks, Mark. Thank you. Um, what I have loved is how wide and how big our RV spot is at. Great place if you're towing, you can park the car really well. The kids really actually enjoyed having the concrete pad to play on. Uh, RV Park Mark brought over a bean bag thing for us to play with, so really nice. Trees are very mature, really nice with shade. Uh, I've got a barbecue pit as well if you want to use it. So overall, space and size is awesome. Uh, for the most part, I think in normal situations you can pull through for us because there was a little bit of some rain beforehand. It was a little bit muddy, so we didn't pull through. We had to back into our spot. But I think if it was the circumstances were different, we'd be able to, to actually pull in, pull through. Mark's got a really cool office, and he even let us come up and play his drums. So Mark's a great guy. The uh, laundry services are actually, they're older, but I would say actually you've got some better convenience because of that the machine's a little bit more reliable. They're a little bit cheaper. And he also has a really big washer and a really big dryer, which makes it actually cheaper to do laundry. We did laundry twice here. Uh, that dryer is huge and so we were able to actually throw all of our clothes in there and dry them all at once and it was really nice. So that was a, a perk. For most RV parks that we go to we use their shower facilities and even though there is one here it's basically just a, a little shack house out by itself. You put a coat in, you go inside and you've got a bathroom and a shower. And it worked for us but it was a little bit different. We, we'd gotten used to having multiple showers and separating uh, men and women in different spots and all going in and getting showered at once but this we, we got a pretty good rotation um, and we never had issues where more people were trying to come in or we were waiting on people or they were waiting on us so that wasn't too big of a deal okay we're taking off overall great park to come by uh recommended if you're coming this way everybody wave bye <laughs>